If I had two dozen roses and an imported bottle of wine, if I really could have hung the moon, would it change your mind? Now, I know most of you out there probably uh, have no idea what I was just singing, but if you are a fan of country music in the 1990s, there was a group called Shenandoah, and they had a song called Two Dozen Roses, and that's what this scent here is inspired by from West Y Beard Company. So I'm going to tell you all about it in just a second. So welcome, guys. My name is Brian. This is my Beards and Banjos YouTube channel, where we try to help you grow your best beard possible. Thank you so much for joining me. And Zach's the owner. He lives less than an hour away from me here in North Carolina. Uh, he's a big fan of country music. In fact, he's a uh, much better singer than I am. He's uh, done done a little professional work and gigging and all that kind of stuff, uh, playing concerts and those kind of things. Uh, so he kind of showed that a little bit here with the, uh, the scent he came out with. Uh, so let's tell you uh, about this scent. So it is Two Dozen Roses, an, uh, an old bottle of wine, lavender, musk, and a hint of mint chocolate. All right. So that's what you get out of it. For me, I get mostly the wine. And I've had, I think I've had this wine smell before, the scent uh, in, in another beard oil that I've had, uh, or actually several of them that's got wine in it. And I, I do like that scent. That's the one that goes on the longest. I get hints of the other, other things. You do get just a little bit of that floral with the roses up front. It kind of goes away a little bit faster. You do get the lavender and this more of the, like the, the woodiness from a natural lavender on the back end. Uh, do, you can get a hint of mint chocolate once you know it's in there. You can smell it. If you don't know it's in there, you can't really smell it. Um, so uh, this is not my favorite scent from West Y. Uh, that's up to you guys. If you like it, you can definitely try it out. I'll give you all the prices and all that stuff in just a minute. I think I'm wanting something a little bit darker to go with it, uh, just to kind of give it a little bit more depth, some black pepper or some uh, tobacco or something like that, I think would go uh, well with that particular scent. Uh, but you can pick it up for $17.99 for the oil. You can get a two ounce butter for $17.99. That's a great price. And this is one of the smoothest butters uh, that you will ever find. Uh, and I forgot how good these products were. Uh, I haven't used West Y stuff in a while. I've got some, well, I've got uh, uh, plain Jane here, unscented butter that I use quite a bit. Uh, and it's uh, very good, but an awesome butter, awesome um, oil here for the way it feels. I can't remember if I tried a balm back in the day or not. You may want to go back and check out my uh, first original video on West Wide, but balm $17.99 as well. Uh, a one ounce mustache wax for $12.99. You can get mustache wax in all of their scents as well. Sometimes companies just have one uh, mustache wax that doesn't have a scent to it or whatever. Uh, there are combos available, uh, whether you want to oil butter starting at $31.99. Uh, same thing for oil balm and then it goes up there if you want a trio or if you want all four products including the mustache wax all right uh, the carrier oils in this is really good uh, it does have some emu in it but it's not really heavy on the emu it's a little bit cloudy but not much uh, so it's argan emu golden jojoba hemp seed uh, and sweet almond, argan, emu, golden, jojoba, hemp seed, and sweet almond. Just want to make sure I read them all out. I think I did. And, and so it's not, uh, I, I'm pretty sure that the emu is less than 50%. Uh, I think Zach said they're pretty much equally distributed without giving away all of the, uh, all of the, uh, the ratios there. So it's not heavy on the, uh, the, the emu if, uh, that is a consideration for you. Uh, and then the butter is that with some shea butter in it. And, and as I said, it works super well. My favorite is Noel, which was a seasonal scent, but it sold so well that it's now a permanent scent. So you can check out Noel. Uh, second favorite is Backwoods. Uh, a lot of stuff here is just kind of country and North Carolina inspired and uh, all of that. So uh, what was the percent profile on this one? Uh, pine and cedar wood. So if you're the woodsy kind of person, that's what the backwoods is. It's like walking around outside in the woods here in North Carolina with the pine needles on the ground. And then uh, sun dropping is a, a sun drop is a scent. Uh, excuse me, a drink. Uh, that is here in North Carolina. It's similar to like your Mountain Dew kind of scent, uh, and that works really well too. If you've tried West Y, make sure you put in the comments uh, what your favorite West Y scents are and how good these products work for you. Super good feeling beard for the oil and butter for sure. By the way, I am an affiliate, so you can save 10% with the code Banjo10. And as always, I appreciate you guys watching. We'll see you soon.